Hello everyone, welcome back. We're on Monday, new week, of course. And I have just decided, it's about three o'clock. Quarter past three actually. And I have actually decided that I'm going to attempt at baking again. So ages ago, a lovely neighbour, and like years ago, bought me this, the Biro, Biro, is that how you say it? cookbook because she knows I'm a rubbish baker and these recipes are supposedly very very simple and easy so I've just been having a look through to see what I could make with the ingredients we've got and I have found I'm going to make some uh, ginger snaps that one at the top there so I have everything I need because you need self-raising flour ground ginger which I have Castor sugar, margarine, golden syrup, and an egg. So, and it looks really super simple and easy. So I'm going to make them, and I'll um, let you see what they're like. I'm not going to film it though because I can't be bothered, and it'll just make it really boring. And the last few I've done have been baking, so I'll show you the finished result though. And uh, fingers crossed, it will work. Um, yeah, let's see. I'm a bit puzzled because, so I've mixed all of the mixture together, followed the instructions as it said, and I just don't know whether this looks like it should do or not. It's like really, it looks a bit, oops, just splashed it. It looks a bit lumpy and gloopy and I'm sure it shouldn't be like that, I'll show you. See what I mean? See all like the lumpy bits? Does it make a difference that? Because I put in, um, I had to use ca uh, no, I had to use granulated sugar. I haven't got any castor sugar, and you're supposed to use castor sugar. Would that make a difference? I don't know. So now all I'm supposed to do is to spoon it out into the baking tray. Is it going to work? I guess we'll see. See, is that? I don't know. Is that right? I'm just. It says teaspoons. Oh dear. Right, really? I don't think this is right. Hang on a minute. Okay, Google. Stop. Sorry, I forgot to put the radio on. Um, you're supposed to put them out in um, teaspoons of the mixture. As you saw, I had problems with that, and um, <laughs> I'm really not sure these are going to work out. They just look like blobs of well. I'll show you. Blobs of not very niceness. See what I mean? Hmm. Shall I put them in the oven and we'll see? You're actually also supposed to, it says that you can get, um, it makes 36, that mixture. Well, there's no way there's 36 there and there's not a great deal of the mixture left either. So. I think something is going to go terribly wrong with these, but let's stay positive, let's get them in the oven and let's see how they turn out. Off we go. Right, my biscuits are done. I've taken them out of the oven, I've got them on the cooling rack thing already. I've actually just tried one already and they are very nice. I say biscuits, but I don't know if they are biscuits because it says ginger snaps. Are they biscuits? But I think 
I definitely did do them too big because these don't look like biscuits. I will show you. Look. Look at the size of those. They're rather large. But they do taste very, very scrumptious. And I have just put um, the last bit of the mixture into the oven. So there's another four in there now. Just cooking away. They're a bit smaller, so hopefully they might turn out more like they're supposed to. But they're tasty and that's all that matters. So, yes, I am. Um, I'm just, I mean, look at the size of that. That's a little bit too big, don't you think? But anyway, a ginger snap made by a ginger. <laughs> I'm actually being super duper greedy and I've um, just broken one in half. Really, it's so I can show you what it's like in the middle. Look. It's not so I can eat it at all. Not, of course not. I wouldn't do that. I'm just, um, I was just actually, quite honestly, flabbergasted as to how scrumptious these actually taste. And I know, I'm having one now because I know as soon as the men of the family find out I've made these, they won't last and they'll be gone. So I better get my pick of them right now. So yeah, I'm going to sit and enjoy this with a cup of tea or coffee. Which shall I go for? Tea or coffee? Hmm. Well, so I wait for the last four to finish. They've got four minutes left. And um, then I've got to tidy up all the mess I've left because, like I said before, I'm the world's messiest baker, quite honestly and truly. Good morning, everyone. We're on a different day. Um, so, I just wanted to fill you in on this. So, this morning when I woke up, really, really strange and bizarre, but my eyes, this one more so, was so swollen and puffy. It looked like, or I looked like, I've got two marshmallows, you know, the huge ones, on my, <coughs> on my eyes. And then the eyeballs were just like, in the middle of them. It was really bizarre. They're still a little bit puffy, this one is now, but it's not quite as bad look. But it was all like round there, it was just whoosh. So, um, yeah, I was getting a bit concerned because I thought, I can't be seen with these big marshmallowy eyes. Anyway, as you can see, I look a little bit human. So, yeah, oh, and to add to it, this eye, my poor eye, my uveitis, which is basically arthritis in the iris, has flared up again. So, I'm back on some eye drops. Look, these ones, uh, Pred Forte, they're basically steroid eye drops. So, yeah. Great fun, eh? And now... Right, the um, biscuit, oh dear, it's not focusing again. Hang on, let's try again. Ah, there we go. Yeah, so, do you remember the biscuits I made a couple of days ago? Uh, ginger snaps, they were supposedly called. And, um, sorry, I'm just gonna shut the dishwasher so I don't trip over the door. Um, anyway, they went down very well, although they did all say these aren't really like biscuits. So, because they look like biscuits, and those of you who follow me on Twitter will have seen this already, I decided to rename them. So that is all that's left. That's how good they were. Um, yeah, I renamed them, and instead of, because they're sort of like a cross between biscuits and cake, I called them Cake Kits. And when I told my husband that I'd renamed them and called them Cake Kits, he honestly could not stop laughing. He thought it was absolutely hilarious. <laughs> so I think that that is actually a word that should go into the um, dictionary. Right, we're on another new day. And today, it isn't actually raining. We're in the afternoon. So my son and I are going to go and wash the car. 
So I thought, as we wash the car, I would let you all watch us as well, just so you can see what a fa fabulous job we actually do of, um, yeah, what we make of washing the car. So enjoy, and I'll try not to get you all wet. In fact, I'll probably put you on the tripod in the lounge, so that if we do spray the hose pipe that way, it won't damage the camera. I'm not bothered about you all getting wet by on the camera, so um, enjoy. And we have done. Did you enjoy watching us? I bet you did, didn't you? I bet you all enjoyed sitting with your cup of tea, watching us hard at work. We didn't actually clean it as fast as it looks like we did because um, I have, or, or will have sped it up because otherwise it was about 15 minutes. So that would make it one incredibly boring vlog if it was just 15 minutes of washing the car and then all the other bits as well. So anyway, I think there's probably enough there to fill a vlog. And then um, what with the cake kits, the pop heads and the car washing. So I hope you've all enjoyed it. And um, until next time, thank you for watching. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and see you soon. Ciao for now. Enjoy your rest of the week. Bye.